it means a lot. Um, and like you said, it, it, it always remains special. It doesn't matter who you play. Um, I just think because of the history that we have with them, um, going back to 1995 and um, getting to play them in a final again, it just, just um, I think it brings back a lot of memories for a lot of people back home. Um, a lot of us were, except maybe Dwayne and Dion, um, were a bit too young to, to watch that game, but uh, I think that's where the rivalry actually really um, started in, in mainstream. And um, yeah, I think just looking at the players that they have on their side and um, this guys that we've been looking up to since we were at school, um, guys playing the final games now for them and for us. Um, there's just a lot, a lot that's special about this game. Um, and we're both going for the same thing, which is going to make it so much more um, of an exciting and, and tough match. Uh, but yeah, I think I, I overheard CR earlier to to say you, you dreamt about this is is a bit is probably wrong because I don't think you you do dream that far. Um, but we're here now, and we I'm feeling extremely privileged and blessed to to sit in this in this position. And um, yeah, going to give everything that I can and. If, it, if it's my last game, I want to, want to make, it, make it remembered um, for me as giving everything and, and putting everything on the line. Um, it will be massive, not only for us as a team, but you know what it will mean for the country as well. And um, yeah, it's been obviously four years of hard work, sacrifice, um, dedication that's gone on into this and the planning, you know, from the from the support staff, the coaches, and us as players, you know, sacrificing a lot of time from home. We all know the brand um, and style that, that the, the All Blacks play and how dynamic they can be, but for us it's, it's all about work rate, uh, that physicality, that scrum battle, that line out mauling. Um, and for us, it's, if you've got an opportunity to play for 40 minutes or 45 minutes, it's, it's absolutely emptying the tank and, and giving you everything and, and making sure you leave nothing out, out there. Um, and then the next guy just steps in and takes over. So, um, it's all about an 80, 85, 100 minute performance. It's always big playing against the All Blacks, but to play it in the World Cup final for his number one and two team in the world playing um, head to head, it's, yeah, I don't think it's stuff that you can dream about because it doesn't happen often. I don't think it will happen in our lifetime again to have two teams like this. And um, yeah, we've prepared as hard as we can and we. We, we know uh, what to expect, obviously we might have some new things coming, but like I think for a player to be playing in a game like this, I don't think we'll ever, it will ever get any bigger. So we, we, we're excited, we're looking forward to it, we know how good they are and how good they've been. We know they, they you know, a couple of months ago, they were going through a tough patch and that's how good of a team they are, that's how proud they are of the team. They, just turned it around quietly behind the behind the scenes they were doing their work and, and now and now they're here so I'm looking forward to it and we've had to work I find our way too, you know, and the way that the coaches went the last year or so that when we've played over maybe fifty players to try and find the best. Even the guys that are not here, I think they will be prepared to come and fit in this day. So I'm looking forward to, to, to Saturday. I don't think it will ever be, get bigger than this. It'll probably be the biggest game of my life.